long time. He's been mentioned with the baddest men on the planet for a long time, though. The title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. So here he is making his way to the Octagon for another heavyweight title defense. This has been the baddest man on the planet now for several years, and he has taken on all comers more often than not, leaving them twitching on the canvas, knockout power for days. The question is tonight, with a challenge like this, can he walk out the way he came in as the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world? Tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Two years apart, these two fighters with big differences in height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a freestyle fighter. Making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA. Presenting the challenger, El Tigre. And now, introducing the champion, Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. Lee! All right, this is for the championship. You can give me your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. The fighters touch him up. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, so here we go. Round one is underway. I can't wait to see how this fight plays out because he told us on Thursday that despite his opponent's submission acumen, he's more than willing to engage him on the ground. A lot of times the guys fight with their ego. They try to go and fight their opponent in their spots. Let's see if this proves to be a very bad decision. Big one lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Well, he's the taller fighter and able to land a knee to the body with relative ease there. Just unable to quite find that reach. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this jump. Well, really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Nice leg kick lands. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he gonna do to follow up? Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, he's gonna shut your body off. 
Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Back and forth we go. Beautiful body. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. He's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh! Just misses with the straight left hand. Straight punch lands. Right punch is good. The left also flush. I mean, he's cutting down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. That right hand landed. Caught that. No, there's danger in that too because when you start reaching out to catch that kick, here comes the high kick, and then you're in a lot of trouble. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. The speed at which he throws is crazy. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. He talked a lot to us about his length and his size advantage. He doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it certainly did. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. Also, the taller fighter lands a knee yet again. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Into that leg kick. Hey, he's off balance. Take him down. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Well, you saw us reference in the tail to take DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that check. Nice punch by Lee. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. <laughs> Lee's hook shot blocked. That one was telegraphed. Good job by the defense. He got the turtle in that kick. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Just missed with the straight left hand. Real sneaky body kick. Five minutes in the books. All right, let us now get to some replays from that previous round. Big part of the narrative, of course, those devastating kicks to the body. Yeah, he's in the right stance to throw that kick to the body. And you see now his opponent starting to carry his hands really low. Look for him to go over the top. Now that he's got, a, he's got him set up the way he wants him. All right, so here we go with our next round. DC, you are known for having one of the higher fight IQs in the game, and I would put him on that list after what we saw in terms of the body work there in the previous round. He did a fantastic job of mixing up his target, not headhunting, going to the body, making that investment into forcing a mistake later that will allow him to chase his finish. Big powerful punch land. Now he gets back to range. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh! Oh, big damaging knees here to the body. Oh, nice. Nice. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active.
Just misses there with the left. Big kick lands. Another straight left. Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. He's so accurate. When he decides to attack, it is a sight to behold. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Right hand on point. Oh, here comes the kick. That one blocked by Lee. And he continues to work the body here. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. John, it doesn't. It doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Beautiful spot to land right under the elbow. Just misses with the right. And they separate. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be over the critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Block that kick to the body. Try to establish that jab. Right under the elbow, the body can land. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Slip that offering from his opponent. In the past, we've seen him sort of lean on the toughness. Tonight, he's leaning on the defense. And you see the evolution of the fighter in front of us. He doesn't have to be tough anymore. The more he can slip strike, the longer he can prolong his career. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Great punch landing with so much power. All right, so he connects with another punch there. Kind of targeting that cut, I think. I mean, when you get a cut on your opponent and you see it and it's pouring blood, you continue to attack it. Every time you land, you can see that it splits a little bit more. Great job finding that weakness and really taking advantage of it. Over and over, he's landing with a big body kick. Came of inches right there, Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. That, that knee, knee lands there. That knee hurt him. Check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's gonna stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. Great, okay? I want more of the same. You are controlling the entire fight. Stay sharp, don't get relaxed. So wherever we're at, all right, next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good back and forth action in the previous frame. Yes, it wasn't a firefight. It wasn't two guys throwing the kitchen sink at each other. But you did see times when it came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with his leg kick. Punch is blocked. Punch 
bunches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Lee's kick blocked. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Big kick. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Big elbow there, lands. Man, look at that damage on the right side of his body. Starting to really bruise now. Great punch. Oh, nice. Uppercut is true. Oh! Going to the body now with the kick. That one is blocked, though, by Lee. Beautiful kick. And he landed the right hand there. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that. Oh, slips to avoid the run. Over the top. This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when he was up and low. And now he's got him hurt very bad. Single collar tie now. There's no tell on that leg kick. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. He needs to start looking at the finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Wow. And able to avoid the punch there. Nice slip, finally. Nice punch lands over the top. Liver kick. And they separate. Some of the best kicks in the game that you'll see right there. Right punches there. Fighters exchange in the pocket here. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. He lands flush with that right hand. Nice punch lands over the top. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Got clipped with the right hand. Still nice body kick lands. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Lee gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. All right, that's three rounds in the books. We are headed to the championship rounds. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and in survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round.
work behind our jab. The jab is going to set up those kicks. All right, so here we go. Fourth round is underway. Good what night. is the fighter's mentality Good. when you enter Good. those seminal championship rounds? You understand that you are getting close now. The night is almost over. The goal is within reach now. 15 minutes down, 10 to go. You tell yourself you can do anything for 10 minutes. his opponent still stand. I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach and certainly is making it count this one. Big hook. Big head kick. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, just truly mixing up the target. Sight to behold. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Oh, man. There you go. There you go. All right, we'll see if he can apply pressure inside his opponent's guard here, DC. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Well, not ideal to spend this much time on the bottom, but you can't fault him for his activity. Landing strikes here from the bottom. Nice work by Lee. Back to the feet now. How about that shin? that will finish the fight. Oh, a huge block there. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Oh, man. I think you jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did because I have time where I've been kicked like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. Misses with the left hook. That is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Pretty good job by him there to raise the guard and block the strike, keeping those hands up to protect that cut in and around the eye. He has to keep his hands up. This is not by choice. This is mandatory. It is mandatory that he covers his face. It is mandatory that the body damage is not as important as protecting the eye because the more the eye gets cut up, the more of a chance the commission will come in and say enough is enough, we have to stop this fight. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Nice strike. Big body kick land. Under two minutes now to go. And now he's got that tie clinch. Boy, tie clock. Throws the right hand there. Beautiful body kick. Lee's kick attempt there blocked. Connects with the right. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Just out of range with that right hand. Man, look at the size of that bruising on his body. Oh. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you can see him drive his shin into his opponent. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Nice loop of punch. Powerful leg kick land. Back and forth we go here. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, you're gonna shut your body off. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Lands the right hand. And a nice left hand there on the inside. 
outside. Nice body kick right under the elbow. And there's the buzzer right. indicating the end of round four. Stop. Stop. All right, so that's the end of the round. He got some things done offensively, but defense still an issue. And as such, the cut on his lip is only getting worse. All right, there's the end of the round. We'll show you some of the highlights. It must feel pretty damn good to knock a man down like that. It feels good to knock a man down. And most times, you don't even feel it. It's the ones that you don't even recognize that landed hard are the ones that usually put your opponent out. It landed right on the sweet spot, and he hurt his opponent very badly. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we go, fifth and final round. Punch over the top. Blocks the shot. Trying to kick the leg out. Nice body kick. Out of range with that kick attempt. Big body kick. Head kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. And now he's got the tie clinch. All right, single collar tie now. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. There, huge block for him. Nice punch here. What a body kick. Well, there's a takedown attempt. No surprise that he would go for it there, but unable to get the fight to the ground. Whenever your opponent knows that you're going to try to take it out, you have to disguise it. He did not disguise it. He tried to just shoot a blind shot. It got defended as you would expect it to. His opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Oh, that's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. Probably feels something like that. It has to. This guy is landing this kick with so much force. The issue with that kick, as effective as it is, one gets checked you got the Anderson Silva situation. That's a big strike right there. Pretty good right hand. They continue to exchange. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. Nice kick. A little single collar tie there. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, look at the welts all over that right thigh. Really starting to bruise now. 90 seconds to go in the fight. You got to check these low leg kicks. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. Nice punch there by Lee. Beautiful body kick. One minute to go in the fight. Blocks the strike. 
Trying to find a home for that right hand. That was snuck in. Nice try. in a single collar tie here. It's such a fast leg kick. So a competitive title fight tonight, Daniel, as many expected. 25 minutes, not enough to determine a winner. Slight lean to the champion or what? I do believe he's still champion, but that's why he's the champion. Because when the challenges are the biggest, he usually will step up. Decision is now in. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 50 45, 49 46, and 50 45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, and still the So there he is, and still the baddest man on the planet, the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. It wasn't everyone's expectation that it would go the full 25 minutes here tonight, but whatever it takes is what he said during fight week. And that